Welcome everyone, my name is Jessica and this is Simple, Cheap and Easy DIYs. Make sure you check out my last episode after you watch this episode. First I'm going to start off by taking this bird image that I searched for online and cut that out. Once I have that cut, I'm going to take some old pages from a book and I'm just going to trace those out and I'm going to be using two for this project. This is what it'll look like once I have it cut out. Next, I'm gonna take some of the large craft sticks from Dollar Tree and I'm gonna cut the bottom off of those. Once I have all the bottoms cut off, I'm gonna take a ruler and actually make a triangle on the top of the uh, craft sticks. Once I have those made, I'm just gonna cut that into a triangle point and that's gonna be the uh, wood pieces for our fence. Once I have them all cut, I'm gonna take the apple barrel paint in the color white and I'm actually going to take a baby wipe and just use that instead of a brush. That way a little bit of the wood actually shows through. And once I have them fully painted, this is what it will look like. Next, I'm just going to line them up as you can see here and then just start gluing them down. And you can make this as short or as long as you would like. And this is what it will look like once I have my fence completed. Next, I'm going to take this birdhouse, also from Dollar Tree, and using that same apple barrel paint in the color white, I'm just going to paint the entire birdhouse using the same method with the baby wipe. Once the house is fully painted, this is what it will look like. And now I'm going to start working on the stand. I'm going to take the tumbling tower blocks and I'm going to place two of those together. So I'm actually going to be making four sets and gluing those four sets together as you can see here. And this will be the base for our birdhouse. I'm also going to paint them um, in the apple barrel paint in the color white using the same method with the baby wipe. Once that paint's fully dry, I'm just gonna glue that to the center of the birdhouse. And once I have that securely in place, then I will glue the picket fence that we made to the front of the stand for the birdhouse. Now for added support, I'm gonna take a couple more of the tumbling tower blocks and I'm gonna glue those to the back of the fence. And this is gonna make a stand, that way it'll be able to stand up on its own. Now taking the little birds, I'm gonna place one of them on the front of the birdhouse, as you can see here. And then I'm gonna use this word, the home word that I got at Dollar Tree and I'm gonna paint it in pale daffodil, but you can use any color you would like. And once that's fully dry, I'm just gonna glue that to the front of the picket fence. Now working on the little flower pots, I'm just gonna take two of the little terracotta pots and some of these florals that I got from Dollar Tree and I'm just gonna place those inside of the pot. And you can paint these if you'd like, but since I'm gonna place them behind the fence, I'm just gonna leave them as is. And taking one of the birds and a wooden dowel, I'm just gonna glue that on and place that inside one of the pots and then place it behind the little fence. And this will be your completed little home birdhouse. I hope you enjoyed today's video. Leave me a comment down below and let me know what you think.